This is James Holder for iFilm London. I'm at the Only Fools and Horses convention 2011 in Portsmouth. With me I have British actor Gwyneth Strong. How are you, Gwyneth? I'm very well, thank you. Thank you. It's very, very nice to meet you. Very nice to meet you too. Now, may I ask you, you played Rodney's better half in the Only Fools and Horses series. Is Rodney someone you'd go out with in real life? No. <laughs> I think most women would tell you that. They all love Rodney, but maybe they don't want to go out with him. How was it for you playing such an iconic character in one of the nation's most loved um, dramas? Oh, it was a fantastic experience and we were all really happy together and we all miss it a hell of a lot. So it's really nice to be here today and meet everyone again and have a kind of a reunion. Are you ever taken back by how many people and how big the show actually is? Absolutely. I'm really taken aback by how many people are here today. I, I thought there'd be a few, but I didn't think there'd be this many and my finger's hurting already and it's only lunchtime. May I ask you, what was your personal favourite moment from whether it be Cassandra's storylines or just from the show in general? Um, I think my favourite episode is the, when R Rodney wins the lottery uh, and I just think that's one of the most beautifully written, funny episodes ever. I really enjoyed doing that episode. Um, there's an iconic coat, which I mean, one, one of the episodes you're in with Rod Rodney's name actually in the coat. Um, the jacket, we actually have the jacket here today as well. Great bit of uh, Only Falls Nonsense memorabilia. It is. It's the uh, raincoat, is it? Yeah, the raincoat. Um, that's a lovely, I think that was my first episode, and uh, that was a, a, a really little clever twist that John Sullivan put in there. Um, John Sullivan sadly passed away this year. Um, how, think, how proud do you think you would be that the brand and the Only Falls Nonsense thing is just so, so big even now? Yeah, I think that's, uh, you know, in large part to John, and, and it was very, very shocking, and it's a really sad year for us. It's 30 years, so it should have been one of our happiest, really, and uh, uh, we all miss him terribly. Well, may I say thank you very much for taking the time to talk to iPhone London, and hopefully 30 years from now we'll be here a little bit, a little bit older talking about the same thing. Oh, I really hope so. <laughs> thank, you, thank you very much. This is James Holder with Gwyneth Strong for iFilm London. Thank you. I'm Gwyneth Strong, and you're watching iFilm London. Thank you.